Traditionally, of course, uh, given their fundamentally private and voluntary character, political parties would be largely free from state intervention. They would be largely free to determine their own uh, activities and, uh, and decide on their organizational structures. But in recent years, parties have become increasingly subject to uh, state regulation um, of their behavior and organizations to a degree, according to some, which is far exceeding what would normally be acceptable for private associations in a liberal society. So as a result, parties, their organizations, behavior and so on are, are becoming more and more closely managed and controlled by the state, uh, which makes the nature and intensity of party regulation an important source for investigation, uh, amongst others into, for instance, the quality of their linkages uh, linkages uh, with the state, which is of particular important in light of the debate about uh, the question if and to what extent parties are becoming more closely uh, entrenched within the structures of the, the state uh, in the face of their erosion of their linkages with society. So in this presentation I will explore some of the um, uh, empirical and normative dimensions of this phenomenon. Uh, I'll present the basic contours of the framework for analysis and discuss some of the uh, preliminary results uh, of the first comparative evaluation. And these findings emerge from a large research project which is funded, uh, was part funded by the ESRC and is now funded by the European uh, Research uh, Council, which investigates these dimensions, the changing conceptions of parties and party, party democracy through a focus on party law. Our analysis of <coughs> party laws and constitution shows that first of all, the intensity of regulation has increased substantially over time. There are few if any exceptions in European countries, uh, with few exceptions, European countries tend to adopt more and more laws, which in turn contain an increasingly number of, uh, increasingly more rules in an increasing number uh, of areas. In terms of the particular dimensions of regulation, we see in particular that the importance of the regulation of parties in what we could call their electoral parliamentary capacities, which is the regulation of elections or, or uh, the composition of parliaments, which is a light blue bar, which is clearly the highest in, in the 1930s, 1940s, that has diminished substantially over time. Um, what is increasing in importance, uh, on the other hand, is the regulation of the extra-parliamentary party organization, uh, as well as the party's rights and duties, uh, and in particular the duties of parties, the, the fact that they have to adhere to fundamental democratic principles, uh, and, the, and they cannot um, be of certain ideological or programmatic orientations. 